And yes, we still have Ngazika Chasi, uh, the filling station, to tell us the state of affairs um, in the filling stations in Lagos. Ngazika, you're welcome to the news. Thank you very much. So are the queues subsiding now? The queues in the filling stations across Lagos, are they subsiding now? I think the queue here is going down compared to what happened earlier this morning in Lagos. Especially, okay, currently I'm at, I'm at the Delo Way and the queue here of people that are waiting to get to uh, causing traffic along this. So I think the traffic is still in two years. Gazika, I said, what's the reaction from car users? Okay, yes, I with a few of the car users that are here. They've been complaining of being, of being in the queue for an hour. Some people said they've been here since money has come, trying to get to an hour, but they're supposed to be at their workplace, but they are not yet there because they are trying to get to their cars. A lot of them are really complaining that the government is all up and all that. They are really bitter about what's going on. From the filling station management, how are they handling the situation and what are they saying is the cause of this um, scarcity? Yeah, I spoke at the, at the petrol station that I visited, I spoke to one of the management there and he was complaining about it not being fuel scarcity. He said that the traffic from the depot where they get the yeah, fuel at Apapa, that that is what the case is. It's not as if that there's a serious issue in Lagos that. All the things I've been hearing since morning or since Saturday, rather, has been a rumor. So it's said that everybody should stop panicking, that things are uh, going to be fine. But the people that are there, like I said, the car users, they are really complaining about what's going on. Just a few minutes ago at the station that I visited, there are people fighting there just to get you. And at the end of the day, they have to close the station down and told everybody to leave. So I think they are trying to reduce the number of people that are visiting the station and they have about 14 pumps there, about 14 fuel pumps, but only two functioning. Thank you for this information. We'll get to speak with you later in the day to know how the situation has turned out to be. Thank you for your time. Hello. Hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.